So let me tell you what new cool features we have for you in Time Planner version 3.15. First of all, those are repeating tasks. Those are special tasks that are pinned to repeating scheduled activity or at least one repeating scheduled activity because as you remember, we can pin a single task to a single task to a multiple scheduled activity. So let me show you how it works. So it has a special checkbox as you can see and this task is pinned to a repeating activity and when we mark it as completed, by the way, it doesn't matter from where I mark it as completed, from the schedule tab, from this dialog, from the task list, in categories tab, whatever. It is always marked as completed until the next time the repeating activity occurs. In my case, it is marked as completed until the next workday comes because my activity repeats weekly on workdays. OK, and when I mark it as completed, by the way, note it does not move, it does not move to a completed section of the task list because there will be the time when it will become uncompleted by itself. And let me show you another one. When I have the repeating activity that happens on Sundays, this task pinned to it will be completed until the next Sunday comes. In my case, it's October 17th. All right, and here in month view, in the schedule tab, you can see all the cases when you have those repeating tasks marked as completed and when you have them not. This state of those tasks for every day is saved in the app, as for now. From now on, actually. And one more thing, when you use search and you search for tasks, you can search for one time, for repeating, for not scheduled, for all them together or just some of them. And it is quite comfortable to find specific tasks. For instance, you, can, you would like to search for not scheduled tasks in order to find some sneaky task that was hidden somewhere and you would like to schedule it already. All right, I'm done for now and you have a great time planning.